You know, Muslims are not allowed to think critically or question Islam. In some countries, even questioning Islam and Quran is considered blasphemy and punishable with lashes. Some Muslims are even afraid to ask questions in their mind about Allah or Quran. Why? Because they know Allah will read their mind and will punish them either by sickness, financial trouble, or even death. So when a Muslim starts thinking and questioning Islam, that's a breakthrough. And I want to share with you, this breakthrough is happening all the time in Iran. As an example, the story of Morid. Morid says, I was a very fanatic Muslim, but I did not have any peace or joy. I was full of fear. I had a hard time forgiving others. One day, my friend invited me to his house and he told me that Jesus had changed his life. I knew because I could see what a horrible past he had, but now he was changed. So when he gave me a Bible, I accepted it. When I took it home, I said, but Islam is the best religion. Islam is the most complete religion. If I really study it, it's better than Christianity. So I started comparing Quran and the Bible. In Quran, I read that Allah says, I am the best of deceivers. But in the Bible, I read Jesus says, I am the truth and the way and the life. I read in the Bible that God does not want me to say any lies. He said, even your yes be yes, your no be no. Different God. In the Bible, I encountered the God that forgives me and asks me to forgive others, but not in Islam. After a few months of reading the Bible, he says, I was so hungry, I would stay awake. I would have just a few hours of sleep. Day and night I was studying the Bible because it would give me life, give me hope and would change me. Eventually, he puts his faith in Christ and he says, I, my life has been changed. Now, he says, one night I was watching your program and I had a liver problem for many months and the doctors, all they said it was, you need surgery, you need surgery. So that night, when you prayed for the sick, I prayed with you, and my liver was totally healed. I know Jesus is the way, not just because he healed my liver, but because I compared Christianity and Islam, Bible and Quran. My friends, some missionaries say, when a Muslim starts thinking and questioning Islam, that's a breakthrough, that's a miracle. If that is a miracle, then I want to tell you, miracles are happening in Iran all the time. Millions of Iranian Muslims are questioning Islam and they're looking for answers. What is our role? My role and your role. Just introduce them to Jesus, introduce them to the Bible, and when they compare Bible and Quran, like Morid, it's a clear decision. Jesus is the winner. When people question and compare, they come to Christ. That's why many Iranian Muslims are coming to Christ, not out of emotions, but because they know what it Islam is, and they hear on the satellite television what Christianity is. I want to thank those of you who are partnering with us to take the gospel to people's homes. And I want to invite the rest of you. Would you join us? Would you join us to take the answers to these people's homes. Because when they ask questions about Islam, we can give them answers, and the answer is Jesus. God bless you.